All right, and welcome back to the show. We're talking all about car accidents and how to make sure, you know, we're safe around this holiday time and this season. So we're going to check in with Craig Swap. Now, this may come as a surprise, but I haven't always been the best driver. I still specifically remember several accidents happening in the winter because I was not cautious about black ice or snow. Oh, and I'm sure there's some of you out there that are just like me. I want to bring in a personal injury attorney, Craig Swap, because he's here to help if you do have an issue like I have. Hi, Craig. How you doing? Hi there, Jenny. Good to be with you. Good. Now, I know you have kids and grandkids. <laughs> are some of them not that great of drivers like me? Don't leave me out. Well, I, I think that just comes without saying for most new drivers, you know, <laughs> I think we've had to fix little paint off of running into poles and, you know, little oh, yeah. things like that over the years. So I think, I think most, most teenagers have a learning curve that they're, we're all working through. And it was a learning curve. And I think as you get older, you start to understand the snow versus the rain a little bit more. I mean, it still can throw you off in any, any second, but for those new drivers, especially it's hard for parents to convey this time of year and driving and being safe. Oh, oh, absolutely. I think the overconfidence of, of our young people sometimes, they just mm -hmm. haven't been around long enough to realize how, how scary it can be when you do hydroplane or that you right. slide on ice or go around a corner too fast. <clears throat> you know, it's, uh, it's one of those things where we've got to really continue to educate our, our young people. And, and, and probably the best way we do that is by being a good example when we drive yeah. in, in the car. Yeah, and especially if there it is snowing, put those devices down. We're always talking about putting the devices down. But, you know, the snow can grab you, pick you up, and, you know, you slide in a, in a second. Yeah, and I think the key is slow down everything during the wintertime. And, and distracted driving <clears throat> is a real problem in our, our society. Uh, we have these safe cars, but, you know, someone's distracted and, you know, bad right. things can happen. So I, I think your advice is really good. Just keep your devices down. Try not to text or email. Um, yeah. Because, you know, the, the reality is that no matter what you're doing, when an accident happens, you know, we can, you know, people can figure out what happened and whether someone was on a phone. Yeah, yeah they absolutely <clears throat> can. And I think what's interesting too is, you know, is doing traffic part time as well. Uh, during the summer, there are so many crashes because everybody is speeding, right? And there's a lot of people on the roads. But then you come to winter, we have less people on the roads, but we see a ton of fender benders because of, you know, snow and different elements. Right, and you add that speeding to, to, to winter driving, it's just, it, it just creates lots of problems. I, I think in Utah, generally, it seems like we drive faster than most states that I go to. <laughs> yeah. Got to slow down. We're just no, and it's, I mean, here, I, I'm we? grateful for it, but at the same time, it creates some problems as well. Yeah, uh, absolutely. Well, if people do have any issues and need to contact you for any reason, how can they do so? Uh, CraigSwap.com is our URL, or 800-404-9000. We'd be happy to help anybody uh, answer questions or do what we can to, to kind of get you on the, the right track. Absolutely. Well, stay safe out there, Craig, and good to see you. You do the same. Thanks, Jenny.